Hi guys, this is Sana. Today I am back with a very simple yet very glamorous makeup look for you guys. I took out my good old Naked palette too since most of us own it and decided to create a look. I have dark circles. Um, they're not like crazy dark so I don't really have to use like an orange or a darker shade to correct it but definitely like a peach shade. This is by MAC. It's one of here I'm applying my good old MAC Studio Fix in NC25 and I'm using my Sigma Flat Top Kabuki Brush. Applying NYX Eyeshadow Base. Using a blending brush, I'm just blending this soft brown shade in my crease area and taking my time. Applying black shades on the outer corners of my eyes. Now just blending it using a blending brush and mixing the brown and black shades together. Here I'm using this small definer brush by Real Techniques and I'm taking some of this concealer. I'm using Tarte Shape Tape but you can really use any concealer for this step and apply it from the inner corners towards the half of the lid. Now I'm doing this step because I really want my lighter eyeshadow to pop. So on top of that concealer, I'm applying this champagne shade using a flat brush and I'm just tapping in the eyeshadow. Blending the eyeshadows in the crease using a blending brush. Now filling in my eyebrows using this e.l.f. eyebrow gel and I'm just using my spoolie to do this step. It's like my go-to step. All the mess around the eyes will be clean after I remove the stick. Here I'm applying my NYX Wonder Pencil in Nude in my waterline. Another benefit of applying and removing the tape is that you get this nice little guide to apply the eyeliner and you can create this beautiful winged line. Same thing for the other eye. You can just use that line to, you know, make a little wing and then just extend that line towards the inner corner. Pencil brush blending the brown shade under lower lash line. Here I'm using my Anastasia Beverly Hills foundation stick in shade Milk to contour my face to blend in that darker contour shade. I'm using this Morphe's flat brush. I didn't know that this bronzer would be so pigmented. Using this loose bristles brush to just blend in that bronzer. From the same palette by Becca, I'm applying this lighter pink shade on the apples of my cheek. As you can already tell, this is my favorite palette. I'm applying Prosecco and Champagne Pop. Applying NYX Cosmetics Soft Matte Cream in this reddish pink. Honestly, I did not like the shade with this makeup. I will be changing it. To tone down that red color, I'm applying Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in Stripped. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you have any particular look, please let me know. Thank you for watching.